According to APD, in the majority of serious crimes that are happening in the city, 14% of those cases involve a homeless suspect. APD also addressed downtown stats in a work session. When we're looking at our violent crime incidents, especially in the downtown area, that a small minority of them involve a per, an individual experiencing homelessness. Mayor Steve Adler says this proves one thing. People need to know that, that if you are experiencing homelessness, you're much more likely to be the victim of a crime than to perpetuate or to commit uh, a crime. Uh, and there's no evidence that our change in ordinances have contributed to an increase in violent crime. This conversation comes after recent stories have circulated in the media, the most recent being a man who threatened children at a playground. He spoke about how something shows up on social media, uh, not supported by the evidence or the data, uh, and then it gets kind of spread around and gets a life of its own. We asked about the numbers and if they should be analyzed on a per capita basis when it comes to violent crime. And when you're dealing with numbers that are so small, it's really hard to really draw conclusions because the numbers are not statistically significant. We had five murders last year using knives. Do you know how many of them concerned people experiencing homelessness? None. That's not what I've heard, and I think most of them are being committed by the homeless. Most of them are not committed by the homeless, but the homeless are a very small part of our population in Austin. Some in that population are responsible for several violent crimes in downtown Austin alone. Sharon Blythe started a petition to recall Adler and Kitchen, Kathy Tovo, Natasha Harper Madison, and Paige Ellis. They're in a voting block with the mayor and trying to pass all these uh, anti citizen initiatives. She feels council should do more to protect citizens but also get help for the homeless. And if they have millions of dollars, they could be doing that effectively and spending their money wisely instead of passing more and more homeless initiatives that, uh, where that gives them more and more uh, free, free leeway to do anything they want to do. The mayor believes when it comes to the homeless population, public perception has been skewed by social media. Social media that picked up on the two stabbed at Freebirds, tourists attacked on the Ann Richards Bridge, and others. We've had an incident this year uh, where someone was killed uh, involving someone that was experiencing homelessness. Do you then conclude that uh, now that kind of crime is associated with homelessness? We have so few incidents that it's really hard to draw uh, broad conclusions.